Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to another episode of Let's Mache It Up. I'm your host, Mr. Mache, and today we're going to be getting into making a paper mache pumpkin. In episode one, I showed you how to make a paper mache balloon. I have one that I've made with four layers of mache. First step you're going to want to do is push in the bottom so that way it can stand flat and even. Next, using some general purpose masking paper, we're going to want to cut a sheet and then measure it to see that it can reach from top to bottom. Once you have the size you need, you can take the sheet and cut it in half lengthwise. Next, we're going to want to take one of the halves and fold it in so that the edges meet in the middle. Afterwards, we're going to tape the ends so that it stays in place. Next, we're going to start taping it to the balloon. If you have any extra length, just cut it off. Repeat this step depending on the amount of ridges that you want on your pumpkin. I'm stuffing these in between because I ran out of space in the top, but I'm still going to tape them to the bottom. Just go ahead and do that as many times as you like. Next step, I'm going to take a sheet of paper and roll it up to create the stem. Next, I'm going to twist it and then tape it. Next, we're going to take this end, split it, twist it, and then tape it up. Once it's done, we can now tape it to the top. Once everything is secured in place, we can start putting on the machine. When adding the mache, make sure to get it in between the gaps. Continue until it's completely covered. Once it's dry, you can mark it and cut it. Next, let's add some mache to reinforce it and keep its shape. Now we can start to paint it. I'm going to give it a traditional look by using green and orange acrylic paints. And there you have it, how to make your own paper mache pumpkin. Thanks for watching episode 2, I'm Mr. Mache, and as always, have a good one.